The final recommendation hype. Many sources will suggest you that it is extremely important to have a perfect final recommendation. Um, however, based on my observations of a lot, a lot of evaluative discussions in an MBB interviewing setting, um, I cannot second this. I cannot second this. So I have not, I cannot remember a single instance where a final recommendation was decisive for a candidate to receive an offer or a rejection, right? It simply was, did not matter. It simply did not matter. It simply was not important for either or, right? So yes, it's a, a puzzle piece of the full picture, but not more than this. So let's make sure you keep it simple. You raise or repeat the client's questions right throughout the case. You give a top-down answer, meaning answer first, then one or two supporting facts for that answer and figures, and then you speak about next steps and risks. That's it, right? If you're not sure about the length or the detail, you can always uh, keep yourself concise and short and offer more details if helpful for the client, but that's it. So make sure you're not over complexify something and putting energy into something that is not of high relevance later on for your evaluation. Hope that was helpful.